with Colton Howard Sports Report. Sports coverage you can count on. The Macedons finding it hard to catch a break early into their Horizon League voyage. First, it was cancellation after cancellation. Then the Dons supposed to play IUPUI last week, only to get it changed to Cleveland State the day before. Now tonight, the first time in over a month, PFW men's basketball had more than a 24 hours notice of who they were playing, and the game was actually played. We head over to the Gate Center for the first game of PFW's weekend doubleheader with Robert Morris. First, first half off the give and go. Demary Black swings it in the corner to Dimitrik Horton for three. That puts the Dons ahead by seven with 13 minutes left to go till halftime. A little later, the transfer from Loyola, Chicago. Jalen Pipkins drops off a silky delivery to Dylan Carl and is finished with the gentle jam. Carl going six for seven from the field tonight with 12 points. Under eight to play till halftime. John Williams lets one fly from deep. Cuts the PFW lead down to just one. And Robert Morris comes back for the win, 102-88. I still think our group is going to be a really good basketball team, um, but we just got to keep getting better um, every single day. And, you know, I, I, I like the fact that, you know, a target of ours this week coming off the last week was, was, uh, was limiting turnovers. And, you know, we, we, we kept our turnovers down to 10. Um, you know, I also, a big goal of ours going into this game was an attack mentality offensively, and that would limit turnovers. But also I want, you know, we want to win the, the free throw battle, which which we did tonight. I mean, we we made more free throws than they attempted, um, but uh, we just got to keep getting better. PFW and Robert Morris square off for more Horizon League action from the Gates Center tomorrow at five.